Hey guys, um, I thought that these uh, products I'm about to show you deserved uh, their own video instead of including them in my sport haul because I really want to talk about them. They're new products for from Bare Essentials. They are the Bare Minerals Marvelous Moxie uh, Lip Liners and Lipsticks. Um, the boxes look like this. Oh my god. Goodness, okay, I started out just buying one lip liner and one lipstick. I was like a girl and I was using them and I could not believe how like creamy, long lasting, and opaque and smooth they were. So I marched back to the Sephora store and I bought some more. <laughs> anyway, I want to show you guys how pretty these are because they're really great. The lip liners for one, super long lasting and they go on amazing. I have a lot of um, the Makeup Forever aqua lip pencils and also the matte pro longwear pencils which both of those are extremely um, similar formulas but they tend to skip on the outside of the lip and they also tend to the longer you wear them get kind of gunky um, in the corners of your lips and on the outside and they can they can get kind of icky depending on how um, how long you wear them and what you wear on top of them or underneath them so um, I do like them because the colors are great and they last a long time but um, they they can get kind of wonky after a while and can be difficult to use at times like i said depending on what you put on or over anyway we're gonna get back to these uh, marvelous moxie ones these are flipping awesome um the one i have on today is this one here in energized um it looks like i'll swatch it here it looks like that just a really really pretty um corally orange color so like i said it's what i got on my lips um right now and then the second lip liner I got is in Jazzed. And this is the pinker one. Let's see here. Put it right there. It's like that. Really, really pretty. I just, I'm, I love, the colors are gorgeous, but I love the application. The lasting power and the consistency of them is flipping amazing. I really like it. And then the third one I got <laughs> is called Empowered. And it looks like that. More of your neutral type of uh, shade, I guess. So, along with the lip liner in Enriched, I have the new lipstick in Light It Up. Now, these are cool. These come in a packaging like that. It says uh, Bare Minerals on there. And it has a little deal right here. What you do, here, here's the deal. It says Light It Up. Um, this is also what I have. Yeah, did I, mention, did I say that? This is what I have on my lips right now with that... Uh, orange lip liner anyway you take this little button here and you push up on it and the lipstick pops out like that which is cool man I think it's really cool because a lot of times I have problems with the covers of my lipsticks coming off in my purse and then like something else in my purse will stab the lipstick and kind of gunk it up or either get all over in there anyway so that's kind of a nifty idea here is what the lipstick looks like they do have a um, see I, I use it with this lip liner right here which worked out really nicely. They are really moisturizing. They are really opaque coverage. They go on really smooth. Here, let's see, I haven't put this on. I have been wearing this here for about four hours, so let's put some more on. They do have a reminiscent scent of um, mint, which is uh, just kind of like their lip glosses both uh, the moxie lip glosses which they also came out with some new ones of those but they've had them before so same type of a smell as that but these here are like I said really moisturizing and they're really opaque and they wear a long time and can you tell that I'm in love <laughs> anyway I, um, let me read what's on the box about them it says this is what it says it says unleash your inner moxie with a vibrant surge of creamy pigmented packed Pigment packed color deeply hydrates and conditions while improving lip fullness instantly and over time. Now, who don't want that? As far as over time goes, I couldn't tell you because I haven't had them that long. Um, do I believe that? Probably not. But uh, the hydration and stuff, nonetheless, if you have hydrated lips, they're always going to look uh, more plump than dried lips. So, um, these are the claims that they have. Um, I think that they, as far as uh, I don't know about long term, like I said, but for the rest of it, totally live up to the claims on the packaging. I, I rate these lipsticks very high if I had a rating system or a blog or something like that. That's what I would do. <laughs> the second lipstick that I got is called Speak Your Mind. Same uh, type of packaging. Just push up on the little deal and it pops out like that. And this one here is more of a pinky neutral. 
And we'll put it right next to this empowered lip liner, which it's perfect. The two of those together are perfect. I was wearing these the other day. Perfect, perfect neutral uh, lip color. Um, love them. Love them a lot. And then my absolute favorite, favorite lipstick out of the ones that I got is this one here called um, Fly High. And it looks like this. Go figure, right? <laughs> it is a... Oh god, and it smell. I like the smell. I do. I like the smell. It's kind of, it's it's kind of minty vanilla -y type of smell. Anyway, um, it looks like a snob. That's kind of what it looks like. Except for you know, a snob is matte and can be kind of drying after a while. This is awesome. Check it out. That's awesome. Let me grab snob and swatch it right next to it real quick. So here is Snob, and we'll put it right next to that. So there you go. So Snob is a little bit uh, lighter, and there is the other one. But um, I just love them. I think that this the, the Bare Minerals one might be a little bit more wearable for those who think Snob is a little bit more of that kind of Barbie look, you know, which I dig it, but um, I love this. I love this. I love it so much. It's so moisturizing. It lasts so long and I could rave all day about them. Um, unfortunately, I don't think that this lip liner, which is the pink one out of their lip liners called Jazz, I don't think it uh, goes very well with that uh, lipstick. See, it's just a little bit too cool. Um, not cool. Too a bit of a bright pink for that lipstick, which I wish they made a lip liner that is similar to Clinique Sky Violet, which is what I have been using with the Fly High lipstick. But um, they don't, not yet. I hope that they come out with like 15 more colors of these lip liners because um, I'm beginning to think that these are some of the best lip liners I have ever used. And I love them. And I love the lipsticks. And I'm really obsessed with them right now. <laughs> so anyway, um, if you guys have any questions on those, I think they're $18. Um, I'll put how much the lip liners are and how much the lipsticks are so that you guys can know. I got them at uh, Sephora. So... Wait a minute, I got Fly High at Ulta, and I got the rest of the other two lipsticks and lip liners at uh, a Sephora standing store. So, uh, anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, and sure, feel free to leave me any questions or comments, and I'll try my best to answer them to the best of my knowledge. Uh, Y'all don't forget to wear sunscreen, and until later, bye! What, you want to go over there? Look at this guy. Daisy's cute, huh?